And we start with that breaking news over southeast Portland. This is a live look of a really familiar sight in Rose City now. A riot declared on the 100th day of protests here in Portland, just minutes after protesters stepped off Ventura Park and started marching on the streets. You're looking now from Sky 8, where some marchers are still blocking traffic at Southeast 120th and Stark. And you can see some smoke still filling the air after a quick and violent clash with police tonight. Now, the streets are much quieter right now than they were just a couple of hours ago. Police wasted no time tonight declaring that riot. It happened tonight in Ventura Park in southeast Portland. Black Lives Matter protesters had gathered earlier this evening to mark the milestone day. During the day, we heard speeches and cheers, but at about 930, protesters left the park to start marching. And within minutes, this is what happened. This has been declared a riot. All persons must immediately leave the area by traveling to the east. Failure to adhere to this order will send to us. Station for crowd control agents, including but not limited to air gas and warning to We saw tear gas fired from authorities, fireworks fired from protesters, and at least one Molotov cocktail tossed, starting a fire in the street. And in a separate video, you can actually see a person catch on fire from what appears to be a Molotov cocktail. We're going to show that part of the video to you right now. And warning, you may find this hard to watch. You can hear what sounds like glass break. Then there's a burst of flame right there. And then that person has their feet on fire, stomping into a crowd off to the side. A group of people bring him to the ground, get him to stop, drop and roll right there. And they do ev eventually manage to smother those flames. It looks like you can see him kicking off a shoe there. Now, we also saw a video of a couple arrests. It's too early right now to know just how many people police arrested, but reporters on the ground tonight in Ventura Park say it was a lot. We'll hopefully be learning more later on tonight or tomorrow morning. We'll continue to keep you updated with those details.